Hello everybody, uh, welcome to the CCL Season 50 quarterfinal round. Uh, Kalon's here with me to discuss these. So, I as am. You, hello, as you can see the draws there. We've got a final boss 50 is Tempest Souls Dark Elves. Up against My Hopes and Dreams Season 50, which is Toast Guys Undead. Then we have Cyber Knights Not Burts, which are a horrendous chaos team. Up against Crystal Hunters Skaven, which are the Crimson Blood Critters Season 50. Then we have Le Danger Wonk, which is Martin Septim's Bretonians with his Strength 5 Wonder Boy. Versus Rumin Max, which is Singolo's Dwarves. And then the final one is a Wood Elf Mirror. Between Mankiz, trying to try hard, and Ducky, a miserable green haze. So let's have a look at the things. Pretty exciting games coming up. An absolute uh, masterclass in who's who's, or who is who of, uh, of, of Blood Bowl. Um, I'm super hyped for this. It's a really, really exciting uh, uh, quarterfinals coming up. We we'll yeah. start off with uh, Tempest Souls um, Dark Elves. So, uh, if you haven't watched it, YouTube, you should definitely go and watch the game that uh, got this team to this uh, place. Uh, probably one of the best games we've watched in Chalice for a long, long time. An absolute brilliant, uh, classic game between uh, Rick Reckless and his Lizards and Tempest Soul and this Dark Elf team. Um, came down to the wire was oh, just brilliant. Just go and watch it if you haven't already. Yeah, it was unbelievable. Uh, probably the best I've seen Rick ever play. And uh... I agreed, agreed. He played his ass off, and uh, yeah. Uh, but Tempest Soul did manage to uh, get the win as well. So I mean, fair yeah. play to him. Uh, yeah. It takes two takes two people, two coaches to make a really really great team. Um, did pick up an injury on that guy. Uh, didn't happen him because he had better things on the pitch, um, and has bought himself an extra lineman already. Actually, which is yeah. kind of cool. And he could get another one, right? He's he's got eleven players at the moment. He's got five blodge step. Um, not too exciting team, but um, you know, sixteen sixty, very TV efficient. Yeah, uh, super super efficient. And the blodge step is just doing a huge amount of work for him. Does have a guard. Yeah. Does have an edge boy. Um, you know, has everything you want. Maybe missing a couple of extra uh, red numbers or maybe some extra doubles and stuff. But it's pretty decent for what it is. Yeah, but this is a nightmare for him, isn't it? Because he's not getting a wizard. <laughs> yeah. Toast guy's 1640, so this is like this is pretty pretty much the dream match for Toast guy, right? It's, it, uh... it's pretty spectacular. It's two nice mummies. One with one with block is pretty great. Uh, shame about the rookie white. Uh, had an option of maybe getting the score on him as well, but he failed to yeah. pick up in the last action of the of this of turn 16. Yeah. And uh, yeah, and down some goals as well. Only two goals is very very light. Yeah. Um, has three DPS, you know. Has a lot of other stuff, but it's not. It's not a. It's not an amazing um, undead team. But then, I mean, what, what's an amazing undead team look like? Uh, he has at least three healthy players. Well, healthy-ish. He's got a mighty yeah. blow tackler, Jim. That's all you want, right? He's, he, well, you really want a pom. You really want a pom tackler. Um, but and you really obviously want more than two tackle. But it's got just about enough that he might be able to squeak this one. I think. Uh, that's, that's, yeah, I think so. It's pretty decent. Uh, yeah, it's 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 a it's a really nice uh, um, matchup for him because uh, he has some tackle, he has some mighty blow, and uh, and it's it's delves that don't have in the inducements. Yeah, and then this is Cyber Knight's team, the big bad scary team of the tournament. Down to he's lost a few players, hasn't he? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven players right now. Can make it twelve, but um, yeah. That's he's this is this is dangerous for him. This is very dangerous for him. Um, it, incredibly so. So I mean, it's an obviously a lovely team. We we commented at the very start saying that this is probably the nicest team in the tournament. Um, the Warriors are lovely. Real shame to be missing that stand firm, uh, and a guard as well, and a claw and a mighty blow. And you know, it's a warrior. In addition to missing his uh, his proper claw, proper claw palmer as well, who um, was the tackle claw palm. So well, he's got he's got uh, two oh, tackle he's, he's club on, two. but this Sorry, one's got guard extra. That. Yeah, this one's got that guard one's got guard extra. extra. So I suppose it was surprising to take the guard as well, but we'll we'll not go into that. Absolutely yeah. beautiful ball uh, fondler uh, in the form of that vampire goat. Uh, yes. Blood, blood, sure hands, strength four, agility four. Fua. Fua. That's a lovely goat. But yeah, only only eleven or twelve players. That this is going to be. I mean, he's, he's going to have to go at twelve probably, right? Nineteen hundred TV. I, um, I think he will, and uh, it's even more worrying because uh, missing those couple of players and having to go up to 1900 TV, uh, I mean, 
there's good and bad to missing those players. The bad is that uh, he's missing the players. The good is that this team does not get a wizard against him, which is pretty massive. I mean, this team, go. this team yeah. might go to 2050. He might, he might literally sack this injured guy and buy two more players and go to 2050 and have 16 men. 16 men versus 11, this could be. <laughs> yes. And it wouldn't surprise me if he did it, to be honest with you. Um, it's a really nice team, Jim. I really, really like it. Uh, the two Storm Vermin are absolute lads. Um, one with uh, Strength 4 Claw Mighty, and the other is uh, Frenzy Piling on Claw Mighty. Uh, with jump up as well. I didn't see the jump up. That's fantastic. So, uh, yeah, two absolute beautiful killers. Uh, who've been doing just that all the way through Chalice so far this season. Um, really nice rats as well, has the agility 5 ball hawk with the leap and sure hands and has the strength 3 blood step guard, who's pretty lovely. The other two look grunt runners, he's got a fake natty who's a bit shit and he's got a rookie because uh, he lost one in the first round. <laughs> this should never have got skills on him, this is just the guy who gets punched to protect everyone else and he's still a gutter, right? He yeah. can still do some things, but he's still always the first one removed. He he's exactly. always the first one removed. And uh, yeah, you know, the ghetto natty does enough, right? It it, it stays on the bench and Perfectly it's it's cheap fine. and yeah. it, it only needs one push. And yeah, yeah, two dirty players and and a big bench means that he's very likely to outbash the chaos in this game. Like crazy, but he's yeah. actually very likely to outbash the chaos. And and if you get yes. outbashed versus Skaven, well, good luck, you know. With the, yeah, you're in a, you're in for a hard time. Yeah, so this is a real, really, really dangerous game for um, Cyber Knight. Yep. Yeah, right. fantastic game. I'm super excited. Uh, really looking forward to seeing how they get there. Um, Again, uh, really great coaches. Uh, no, they're we're, we're very familiar with them in Chalice, and uh, and it's going to be quite the battle of the titans. Yeah. And now boy got, howdy, boy howdy. Ninety uh, case, we can't really add anything to this. Where he could he could have subs, I guess, but thirteen players, um, four guard. Burt's is nice, right? And then Perfect. he's got the absolute minimum on the blitzers, like they're all blodge, and he's got a tackle yeah. one to, to hit with. He's got the uh he's got the ad show hands one to player. carry with, and then he's got the, the yeah. super duper strength five wonder wonder player and one dirty player. So it's two rerolls, very min max. So min max. Fifteen sixty T V, but actually yeah. surprisingly good and in, in the quarters with it. Oh, it's it's a really well put together, and uh, well, Sambo Simon as he is in chat, uh, Martin Septum as we all know him as the coach. Um, I mean, he's pretty good. He plays a lot of everything. Um, it's really, really tidy. It's really well put together. It is Burt's, which is obviously a big failing against it, but it's Huge. very nice Burt's. And I mean, what more do you want than those three, the, the four, the four blockers with guard, two at stand firm as well, which is brilliant. Uh, means you can kind of control the pitch quite a lot, especially with the fend as well. Uh, you'd probably like to have seen the fourth blitzer. You'd probably like for most of the, all of three of those guys to have uh, sidestep, but it's just it does everything you need to. I mean, you can get Dalfar. <laughs> Shut up, Kalo. <laughs> <laughs> right. But no, it's it's really cool, and I, I think it's great. I think it, like I'm, I'm not that surprised he's, he's got as far as he has because it, it kind of does everything it needs to. Well, he, he might not get any further because he, <laughs> he's up against 1760 at the moment. This team, um, and it's just it's just horrendous. Loads of yep. guard, loads of mighty blow. Not that much stand firm. Well, I guess he'll have three stand yeah, firm, which yeah, which might help him much. versus the elves or chunter if he gets to play any of them. Um, yeah. And yeah, an attack, uh, well, not a tackle bomber, a frenzy bomber. Might get tackle mm. soon or juggernaut. Yeah, and, he'd uh, love to have tackle for the next game, wouldn't he? Because yeah. he's going to be trying to use that Dauntless up against that big strength five bio. And then, and but, then um, this this runner with armor instead of move, hilarious. It's hilarious. It's hilarious. And the amount of times that he used it. Well, he he got stabbed into injury into removal, which was pretty hilarious by Skater <laughs> stab stab. And uh, he would have been it would have been a much easier game if he'd had move seven. Yes, but uh, well, you know, who's to say what's right and wrong? Exactly. Uh, other yeah. Than, other than what I just implied. So he's yeah. got fifty k in the bank as well. He's probably just going to buy that. I mean, he might buy just buy the fucking reroll, right? Um, he could go to three rerolls. Yeah, that's an idea. Yeah. I, I, I yeah. quite like that personally because I think two I would, rerolls I is a bit too min max. But he do, he does have the leader, so he does have three. He already, does. So. Yeah, but I mean, he's going to have to. He has to. He has to throw away fifty k anyway. He's already uh, made a, a a bit of a. Um, like he's so he's had to take a a blitzer, much to his chagrin, I'm sure. But um, accidentally picked up another agility three useful player. 
yeah. um, in the Blitzer, who, uh, who who he was so far behind against in the game against Mr. Tree, that uh, uh, Miss Bell Tree, that the uh, the Blitzer came on as an extra actual ball ball handler. Yeah. Um, but didn't uh, didn't get the score. Yeah. So yeah, really 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 good team for a single. It's and yeah, terrifying. He'll probably just exactly burn the fifty. To be honest, I don't, I don't think he'll yeah, go four re rolls. But um, but I wouldn't hate I, doing it. Yeah, it's, well, it, with the discrepancy between the teams as it is, um, I don't think it's going to make a, that big a difference. All right, well, now so we've got... I would certainly consider it. Yeah, yeah, you might consider it. Now we've got Mankiz with a 2000 TV Wood Elf team. And, oh, uh, Singolo was in the chat saying he thinks he might sell the Blitzer. <laughs> <Sure>. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's pretty, that's pretty funny. <laughs> uh, cool. So, uh, yeah, nice Mankiz and his lovely, uh, lovely Wood Elf team. It's, pre it's pretty cool. Um, it's got pretty much all of the stuff you want. The the interesting thing about it is that we're, we weren't blown away by it because the dancers aren't really very special. Yeah, but the rest of the team damage. is really cool. It's all right. Yeah, Not, it, there's nothing special, is there? Like two move ups is oh. nice. One's got sprint. Uh, there's a guard. Well, a couple of guards oh, and Andrew. three three guards. Yeah. yeah, three guards. One of them on the catcher is really really nice. Like three blood steppers. Two of them are move nine. One of them has to sprint as well. Are the the, the, the sure feet, sure I should feet, say, because yeah. they come with sprint actually, would have catchers. Yeah, do they? All right. Yeah. yeah um, it has the agility five uh, five uh, linemen as well as a Raj lineman. I mean, it's a really cool team. It is 2060. Uh, it's just that we, we were expecting, like, it doesn't have a block or move three, it doesn't have mighty blow or edge dancers. Yeah, and that's kind of the, the the bit where we kind of go. Oh, it's okay, I suppose. Yeah, it's fine. It's it's a two thousand TV Rudolph team, so it's it's obviously you know there's a level there, like you know a level of that you expect, and it's it's just not that exciting. It's just literally yeah. not that exciting. Um, but you know, obviously, well coached and everything, and and it's 100%. still a great team. But a this is record, really good. Yeah. This is both. This is good. This has actually got everything because this yeah. is. Coached by Ducky, it's 2,200 TV. He's got yeah. adjups, he's got strengths ups, he's got a move up. He's got some injuries as well. Got some guards. Sure. Um, but I mean, they're just they're mostly chaff, and they're also developed chaff. Um, has a level pending as well. Has some money in the bank. Uh, it's really great. The strength agility guy is fun. The block tree, the guard tree. Um, yeah, two really, really nice dancers because they both have agility five, which means they can do whatever the fuck they want. Uh, has a move up sprint as well. Uh, move up sure feet, I sorry, I should say. Um, has the blood stepper. Shame about the rookie dancer, but also has two guard as well. So, I mean, it's a really, really nice team. I really, really like it. And it's being coached by Ducky, so. Yeah, yeah. So, um, there you go. I mean, that's what can you say? It, it looks really cool. So, obviously, we'll do all these four games live if we can. Um, we will. And uh, yeah, that's it. That that's the quarterfinals for CCL season fifty. Thank you very much, Kalon. Being great having you on as always. Ah, thanks, Jim. You're very kind. Cheers for having me. Oh, thanks, and thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>